I'm just gonna rip the band-aid off. We're gonna get all of our snipers done today. Last time we got our cat AMR done, but today we need to get our longbow and our KV inhibitor done. And these camo challenges are gonna be pretty similar across all the snipers, but there's just a few minor differences. To start, we need to get 250 kills with it, so that's not terrible. Then we need 250 kills with fire damage on it, so we need to go ahead, hop in, and try to find napalm burst ammo mod. Then we need 250 kills with this being rare or higher rarity, so we need to find an aether tool for both of these guns. And then we need to get 200 critical kills with each sniper. And when that's all done, we need to get our 100 kills in exfil. And then once we get that on all of our snipers, we'll have Zerk on scale, or at least we'll have the opportunity to go for it, because then we need 300 kills with each sniper while it's pack-a-punch. This is actually a lot more than I thought it was going to be. And as for our KB inhibitor, we have the same challenge for our first base camo, which is getting 250 kills. Then we need to kill five mimics with it. Then we need to get 250 kills with fire damage, just like our previous sniper. So we need to find another napalm burst ammo mod. And then we need to get three kills in a single shot 30 times. So we need to be collating some zombies today with this. And of course, the golden enigma and the zircon scale challenge is going to be the same as the last one. But we got a lot to get done. So let's go ahead and hop in. And I have both of these weapons only at level one. So we got to get these leveled up as well. And last time we played, I disconnected in the middle of the game. My internet went out. So I lost my large backpack and I have no self revives. So we're playing a little risky right now, but that's fine. We, we just got to get in this game and try to find a bunch of stuff to bring out with us. But for right now, my main focus in this game is find napalm burst and try to get as many levels as I can while getting our first camo done. I already have a feeling that I'm like these snipers way better than our cat AMR. This is so much faster. And to start us out, I'm going to do a few extracts. That way I can guarantee that I'm getting a few levels here, getting a few kills towards our camo and we can get some points so I can go ahead and grab pack a punch as well. It's funny how one of the best ways to start out a game of Modern Warfare Zombies is to do what you got to do to exit. All right, I've done two X fills. We only got 2,000. The money's not good enough to keep doing it. Time to do some cargo deliveries. Oh, a stealth revive. Give me that. What? Well, that's dumb. I went to go change my game to like full screen because I was getting a few frame drops and I got knocked and apparently I stowed my self revive instead of equipping it. So now I lose it unless uh, there's anybody nearby that can help me. Everybody's way too far away. All right, we'll, we'll just take the L on this run. That sucks. Actually, that could be really bad. Yeah, we don't have our insured weapon slot. Do we have a sniper in here? We do not. Okay, well, here's what we can do. Go to our strike team and we can recruit an operator. Oh, no. I thought I found a loophole. I didn't. Well, I guess we'll just do a quick run of the game. Try to do a few contracts. Get some items and exfil. That's really disappointing. They do not need an insured weapon slot in this. I guess it is an extraction shooter, but it's kind of annoying for grinding camos. I guess it's time to suffer the consequences of my own actions. Oh no, come on. No way I Austin powers the car right near the end of the mission. This is dumb. I just can't catch a break right now. Or at least I have another contract right next to it. Oh, we got an eight bomb burst. So I'll stow that and make sure I equip the self revive this time. Oh, and there's a rare aether tool too. So we got two items that we need. Uh, we've been in this game for a little bit. I'm going to go to an exfil point, grind out kills for a little bit, and then actually just exfil. And then we'll see if our insured weapon slot's done. No way. I just got killed by the helicopter, basically. Stayed as long as you could. It landed on me and then it immediately wanted to leave? Come on. I'll still just get out of here. But we got two things that we needed. And maybe enough time to get our insured weapon slot back, please. How much time are we taking off? 46 minutes. I think that's perfect. Now we can bring our longbow back and actually start using it. So once I hit level 13, I can put on fire damage. And then once I hit level 21, I can use the aether wrench. I'm going to bring them with me, but I'm not going to equip them unless I hit that level mark. All right, now we can get back to grinding. That's ridiculous. As much as I like the risk and everything of coming in here and like what you grab and take out with you matters, because it's probably smart if I'm grinding, I should probably just buy tombstone every time. So let me make my way over there. Because if I end up going down and dying, again. I want to be able to get my stuff back. All right, just in case I'll be grabbing that. This is the worst spot for a pickup site. Right in the middle of what the hell is even is this? Like a radiation zone? And all for nothing too. Oh, I'm about to die. Yeah, genius pickup spot. And it looks like this exfil spot's being used. They're really, I don't even think there is another exfil spot in this tier one zone. So I'm going to have to pack a punch and we're going to go to another exfil spot to grind. So give me pack a punch and where's a good exfil spot? I'm thinking over here. And now we can start working on our camos and let's go ahead and throw on our napalm burst. I think we're getting close on levels. 
There we go. There's our 250 kills. The least of our worries. Oh, you know, I just remember what we did last time. I had elemental pop. That'll help out a lot. We'll be getting our napalm burst going off a lot more on top of just other ammo mods going off. Oh, this guy's got frenzy guard. What a dick move to come here to the exfil and use it. Just use frenzy guard and took all my zombies away. Find your own exfil spot. I'm about to start growling at people in prox chat. I'll still teabag at them though. Gotta be respectable. Don't let them know your next move. We're gonna be doing this for a bit. Why? We're not even close to getting this sniper done. We still have a whole nother one to do. That insured weapon slot really slowed things down. And I think I am close or at the level that I need to be to be getting our like rare rarity kills. But we only have six minutes left until the Aether Storm comes in. And I'm scared I'm not gonna get enough. And I don't wanna have to try to find another Aether tool. And then after that, when we get this gun done, we're going to have to find another Aether tool on top of that one. So I'm just going to not use it this game. We'll have to play another one after this. Oh, there's our Topo Ash camo. So we're all done with our fire damage kills. Now we just need our crits and our rare rarity kills. So I'm going to stay in this game for as long as I can. Basically until like the last minute. Try to get as much XP as I can. And maybe we'll get most of the camos done. This is actually an insane amount of zombies over here. I ain't even called in the x -fill. This is why I like this mode a lot better than Outbreak. Because you actually get hordes of zombies. This is what I always wanted to see. Ever since like watching The Walking Dead when I was younger and seeing the giant hordes in like the first episode in Atlanta. I've always wanted to just fight a giant horde like that in a game. And look at this. They're all about to die to my energy mine. Ooh! Only 1500 XP? That looked like way more zombies. And if I can get a energy mine we can leave here oh, i do have one all right i'm getting on the helicopter i'd rather get out with what i got than try to force it so we got out with our aether tool and two dead wires i'm pretty sure we don't need either of those but it's nice to hang on to them just in case we do later down the line all right so our first two challenges are done we need to start getting our rare kills here oh wait we weren't even at level 21 yet okay good thing we never threw that on there and we need to get to level 31 so let's just hop right back in all right so first thing i'm gonna do is equip the rare aether tool and i brought speed cola with me just to make it go by a little bit faster i'm going right for an exfil no! Are you kidding me? Checking for update? I don't give a fuck. I just used the Aether tool. I knew the second I used it, some shit was going to happen. Oh, I've been disconnected, have I? Fuck you. There goes another insured slot. This is cursed. So if my internet didn't disconnect and there's no update, what was I disconnected for? Just so I could lose my gun and have another one hour wait? I'm pissed. I guess time to get it back. Nothing else we can do. And I said grinding the last sniper was painful. That's nothing compared to what's happening here. <sighs> This is ridiculous, dude. And apparently I chose the absolute worst weapon to come in here with because for this pistol, I'm clicking and the hammer just goes back and then it shoots. There's a gigantic delay between shots. Like, look at this. I will click and then it shoots three seconds later. My pistol has lag. Again? How am I supposed to play this game? How am I supposed to play it? You have been disconnected from Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 servers. Please try again or visit fuckofuckyourself.com. They're really testing my patience. They're seeing how many times I'll hop back on after they kick me off. But that is yet another weapon lost. At least we uh, killed 10 minutes off of our insured weapon slot. Now, as much as everybody wants to jump on the, the hate bandwagon for the zombies, I'm having a lot of fun playing it when it's actually working. The server disconnecting shit's pissing me the fuck off though. There needs to be a fail safe to where if it says that you disconnect, you get to keep your gear. But I don't know if they'll ever add that because people will definitely exploit that where if they're about to go down, they'll just leave the game. There's just no winning here. This is embarrassing. I just like Austin powers this car right in front of this guy and I'm doing it again. I just gotta, I gotta go. I gotta leave. I gotta get the fuck out of here. I'm making a fool out of myself. Yeah, don't mind me. You know, just uh, driving on through. Do not mind me. Oh my God. I think I already popped the tire and I'm spinning out. I'm fucking driving like SpongeBob. Look at this guy. He's still just watching me. Look away. Go somewhere else. Jeez. Anything. And I mean, literally anything that can go wrong throughout this grind has gone wrong. We're not even done with our first fucking weapon. I'm gonna have an aneurysm. Wow. 
Made it through a full game without getting disconnected. Did we get enough time off our insured slot though? 42 minutes off it. That's not bad. And I can finally use my weapon again. This is the dumbest shit. And about almost three hours in, we can start doing two more camo challenges for this fucking gun. I didn't even bring that the aether wrench with me. I'm an idiot. I'm a dumbass. So maybe we can't. I'm so pissed. <gasps> let's go we got one okay now that we got that let's find an exfil which is pretty close by and start using it and now that we've made it to the exfil we can get back to what we were doing two fucking hours ago if i don't have golden enigma on this gun by the end of this game i'm gonna check myself into a institution maybe i should have stayed in the tier two area because no zombies are spawning for this exfil. I can't win. I'm going back over there. Just more wasted time. I'm pretty sure somebody's already using this exfil location, but they're going to have to learn how to fucking share. All right, I think we're chill. And he's inviting me to his party, so I'll just join it. We might as well share all the power-ups that drop here. Oh, are you leaving? So long, soldier. Godspeed. You actually exfil like that? No, shit. Oh, no, they still got taken. It was nice knowing you. So long, partner. Oh, there we go. So we got our 250 kills with rare or higher. All we need is our critical kills now. We have a chance to get out of here with gilded. Hopefully it doesn't bug out because I've been seeing a lot of people say that their gilded challenges are fucked up and they can hop in and get 2000 kills and it don't matter. Am I lagging again? Please don't say I'm lagging again. This plane's stuck in the air. There's just parachutes. I inspect my gun. Oh, no fucking shot. I'm lagging again. What the fuck? Lost connection to host slash server. I can't catch a fucking break. And it's just like stuck on the screen. Cool. Fun. Awesome. There we go. Oh, I actually didn't even kick me fully out of the game. Oh, I kept my stuff? This is a first? No fucking way. I didn't get a single critical kill though. Oh, because I was on level 31. I'm so angry. I'm going to grab dead shot. I'm going to pick up my controller and we're going to knock these crits out. We've come this far, we might as well just get it done. Oh, nice. Controller disabled. Even though I started the game with the controller, I can't use it. Oh, but I can aim in. Look, I can aim in and move left and right, but I cannot look. I cannot look with it. What else is going to happen? Actually, you know what? I ain't going to test fate because today it's already tested my patience. I'll just go with the fucking flow. Can I even do anything with this all right cool now we just need one more level 200 more crits and then 100 kills and exfil so hopefully we won't be in this game for too long because we're approaching like four hours of this grind with no golds i knew this shit was gonna take a bit i know it's gonna be this long there's our level 31 all right start counting the crits ready one two three Oh, we got our 200 crits now. Good thing I counted every single one of them. Now let's see if they'll give us golden enigma here. We just need 100 more kills. Doesn't matter if they're crits or not. All right. I feel like I've gotten 100 kills since we got our critical kills. I'm leaving with this helicopter. And if we don't have it, I might just fucking lose my mind. Please, please say that was 100 kills. Please show me gold. Let's go. I think we got it. Thank God. Now we just have another four hours of grinding ahead of us. If uh, this last one was anything to go off of. Now we can finally start working on our KV. This whole time I was thinking I would need the rarity thing for this, but I don't. I, I was hanging on to it for nothing. Jeez. Some reading comprehension would go a long way over here. Now we need to fully level up this sniper and get all the camos done for it and find the fucking fire ammo mod. My brain's shot at this point. Oh, and there's our 250 kills right as we fucking go down to die. I have no self revive, but I think there's somebody nearby. Uh, can I plead for help? I'll request to join. Let's see if this guy lets me join. Come on. I've been through enough today. Please don't exfil. Please don't exfil. Hey! Help! Oh no, plea for help. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna get the plea off before he takes off. Let me try this. Can anyone revive me? I'm in H5 near X Phil. And now we see if anybody's nice. Because there's a team right here. A team of five people. The only team in the game. Because if they do go to leave, they're gonna have to come here because this is awful. This game's about to end and I'm about to lose my insured slot again. I don't think they're coming to help. This fucking sucks. And look at this. A whole nother hour we gotta wait. Or we can hop into another game and get a bunch of kills. Uh. 
I hate this. I'm gonna speed run the fuck out of this. All right, after a quick game, hopefully we'll have our insured slot back. We got a half hour taken off of it. God damn it. We have four minutes left. I'm gonna wait it out. This is so dumb. We're back to the same bullshit. Let's hope we can actually do something this time though. Oh, we finally got a fucking napalm burst. It only took 18 games. All right, I still need to kill some mimics. I finally got a mimic bounty. If this thing takes me out, I'm going to bed. Oh, we killed it immediately. Oh, we finally got our fire damage camo. And we're barely surviving out here in the storm. And we're down. But our helicopter's landing. Can I get in it while I'm down? Because this would be the best thing ever. If this rock would get the fuck out of the way. Actually, this might be the best way to exfil if this works. No way. Get me out of here. I'm not losing another insured weapon slot. Please? Let's go! Thank God. How far do we get on the camos for this? All 250 kills are done. All 250 fire damage kills are done. We killed one out of five mimics. And we got no collats. I don't even think we're at the level yet. Yeah, we are definitely not. Holy shit. I'm going to bed. I am on day two, hour six, maybe even hour seven of this grind. And I still need mimic kills. So I'm going to spam these bounty contracts. And I still need to level up enough to start doing our collat kills. Oh, and this bounty is a mimic right off the bat. Let's go. Come here, mimic. Come get some. Bastard. No, no, that's not what I mean. He launched me. I need this guy to not get this kill. As much as you're trying to help, buddy... I need this camo. You can take the heat off me, but don't take the kill. Thank God. Appreciate you. But I was not looking for help. Please be another mimic and let's just get this challenge over with. Oh, let's go. Maybe our luck's turn around today. Come on, mimic. Just go down. There we go. Woo. Just need a few more of those. Like maybe three, but they are not getting any easier. Please give me another mimic. Keep the mimic train going. Oh, beautiful. Let's try to pick them off like JFK. Oh, wait. I could just sit here and do this. This is infinitely easier. He has no idea we're here. This is the easiest camo ever. And it's done. Easy. Come on. One more mimic. It's a mangler. Our luck had to run out somewhere. Can I get this guy from a distance too? This might be the best part about the snipers. There we go. These bounty contracts are super simple if I just stay all the way back. Oh, <gasps> that's a mimic right there. We don't need to do another bounty. He came to us, then it's a lot easier to kill. Let's go. There's our spoiled egg camo, what a name. All right, now we just need to level up and get our collats. Now we're gonna spam the exfil till we get enough levels. There's level 31. All right, we can start going for our collats. We gotta figure out a strat for this. Insta-kill obviously would help out, but these are all level one zombies and we have a pack a bunch one weapon, so we're already one shot in them. We just need to figure out a way to get them all to line up. I'm gonna just throw some decoys and see what happens. That should be one. That should be one. As long as we're seeing the 60 XP pop up when we shoot one bullet, that means we're getting three zombies in that kill or in that shot, whatever. My brain is shot. Oh, there it is. So I think we have all of our base camos done for this gun. Now we just need 100 kills in exfil. And then we can start working on all of our pack-a-punch kills for each sniper. All right, time to escape. Let's hope that we got the 100 kills and we're out of here. Please say we have Golden Enigma. I want to start working on this final challenge. Please. It only shows that camo. Oh, no. I don't think we got it. Oh, we didn't get any. Nothing tracked. Well, I guess you can only do it the one time. Damn, we didn't get enough kills. Guess we got to hop right back in. All right. I'm taking this next XO helicopter. I know for sure that I've gotten more than 100 kills. I'm getting out of here. Let's hope it don't bug out and it give it to me. Come on. Give me my camo, please. How many kills did I get? 436. Right there. The game even says it itself. Let's go. Now we can finally start working on the Zircon scale. So we got Golden Enigma on all of them. And now we need to get 300 kills with each sniper while they're pack a punch. Good thing I got an Ethereum crystal. Let's start knocking these out. Now we don't got to do anything fancy. Just got to throw this on our gun. Kill 300 zombies and get out of here. All right, 21 Savage, we're gonna have to share this spot. Oh, I think he's actually axe felling. Well, that's fine with me. See you later, 21. Shut your ass up. <laughs> he tell me to shut my ass up and then leave. How rude. Now, unlike gold, this should, oh, there it is, right on time. I was about to say, this should be a camo that will pop up. We got our Zircon scale, we can get out of here. Just two more guns to go. Look at that. 
Our first Zircon scale camo. Let's take a little peek at it. Clean. Let me craft another Ethereum crystal. And we might have to find another one this game. Or just get enough money to pack a punch our gun next game. Now let's pack a punch it right away. Throw this tool on. And we're only 600 kills away from getting our entire sniper class done. Oh, this guy's going for the XFL too. Let me invite him to the squad. And he's sniping. Sniper gang. No codec. I don't think you want to join the squad. I guess it's war then. Oh, well, I guess I'm getting kicked out then. Why does I have to check for update mid game? I just lost my Aether Crystal and my insured weapon slot. Nice. Good shit game. Unless they're going to be nice. Let me keep my stuff. Nope. There goes my large backpack. Everything. So dumb. I'm sick of this shit. Uh, well, I guess it's just time to fucking run contracts and get kills to lower my insured weapon slot time. All right, let's exfil and hopefully we shaved off enough time. I swear if I have to do this again for these next two guns, I'm gonna be pissed. I'm sick of losing all my hard earned shit from a disconnect. I get it if I die. I literally didn't do anything. All right, we got it back. Should have never lost it. And we still have a cooldown on our Ethereum crystal. So dumb. I'm bringing Tombstone with me just in case. Time to pop my perks. No perk is set. And we need to get enough money to be able to pack a punch. All right, we finally got our pack a punch back. Now let's not fucking lag out. Oh, there's Zircon scale. Let's go. There we go. That's our second Zircon scale. In case you've been wondering about these builds, all I've been doing is throwing on like highest damage range barrel, uh, highest damage range suppressor, biggest mag, fastest rechambering speed, and then some hip fire. Probably not the greatest build, but it works for zombies. Okay. Last gun. Just need this pack a punched. Need 300 kills. And I don't have to touch a sniper until we get every single class Zircon scale. We gotta be getting close. I've been doing this for a little bit. I can smell Zircon scale. And it smells like shit. Oh, there it is. There's Zircon scale. All of our snipers are now done. All we need to do is just exfil and get out of here. Let me put down a little sentry gun so we can get out a little easier. If these fucking zombies will let me do it. I'll put it right here. It's got a clear view of the helicopter. Quick nade for him. And now let's leave. Get me out of here. Go ahead and take off. We're good to go. Leave. Let's go. Woo. This fucking journey. Suck me in an additional three hours. I think there was a nine hour grind. Definitely did not need to take this long. A few less deaths, a few less disconnects. Would have cut this in half, maybe. Let's double check. Make sure that we have it over here. Sweet. All right, let's hop in game and see what it looks like there. The pain is finally over. Our snipers are now Zircon scale. This is what it looks like on our cat AMR. Honestly, the camo looks a lot better in my hands than it does in the menu. Wish it was a little animated, maybe a little more vibrant, but not a bad camo. This is it on our longbow. Doesn't look terrible on here, but this is the least sniper looking sniper in the game. This is like an AK with a big scope. And last but not least, this is our KV inhibitor with it on. So glad to get this done and out of the way. But I'm absolutely pooped. I need to get out of here. But first, I want to thank you guys for all the support you've been showing me since this game's came out. We've already gained like over a thousand subscribers. The videos have been doing pretty well. I just really, really appreciate you guys. Thank you guys for showing me so much love with this new game. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.